Hi, my name's Nolan Bushnell. I founded Atari and Chuck E. Cheese, and right now I'm getting older. And while I really can't help getting older except by dying, I don't want to get dumber. And so I'm trying to do everything I can to exercise my brain, to keep it young, to keep it dynamic, and constantly uh, push myself into new directions. What I try to do over and over again is to do different. For example, I like to play chess, but the neurogenesis of chess for me, most of it happened when I was eight and 10 years old when I learned how to play chess. Uh, right now, it's just habit. It's, you know, I know all the rules. So the trick is to learn new games, do new things, and so I've devised the dice game. And my dice game is something I do January 1 of every year in which I have 30 things that I think I can accomplish in a year on the side. And, um, and then I pull out of the hat 11 of them and then throw the dice to determine which one I want. And I say, why do you have all those? And it's because we will constantly self-edit or select based on what we perceive as the littlest amount of pain. And what your brain really is best at is the most amount of pain. The more uncomfortable you are, the better off it is for your brain science. And so when you have long lists, you're bound to get some things that you really don't think you can do. And um, and it's worked wonderfully for me. For example, I, four years ago, it came up, write a book. Now, I'm dyslexic. I can't spell at all. I would have never graduated from college or even high school without um, somebody editing my papers. And so I self-thought you know, I'll never get something published. But now because the dice told me to do it, I said, okay, I'll write a book. And I wrote a book, and then you figure out, hey, you can get somebody to edit, you can get somebody to clean it up. And before you know it, I was a best-selling author, all because of the dice. So I suggest if you were worried about maintaining your intellectual edge as you get older, do different things.